The Return of the Prodigal Son, Dutch, De Terra Kier van de Fair Lorenzoon, is an oil painting by Rembrandt, part of the collection of the Hermitage Museum in St. Petersburg. It is among the Dutch master's final works, likely completed within two years of his death in 1669. Depicting the moment of the prodigal son's return to his father in the biblical parable, it is a renowned work described by art historian Kenneth Clark as a picture which, those who have seen the original in St. Petersburg may be forgiven for claiming as the greatest picture ever painted. In the painting, the son has, returned home in a wretched state from travels in which he has wasted his inheritance and fallen into poverty and despair. He kneels before his father, in repentance, wishing for forgiveness in the position of a servant in his father's household. Having realized that even his father's servants had a better station in life than he, his father receives him with a tender gesture and welcomes him as his own son. His hands seem to suggest mothering and fathering at once, the left appears larger and more masculine, set on the son's shoulder, while the right is softer and more receptive in gesture. Standing at the right is the prodigal son's older brother, who crosses his hands in judgment, in the parable he objects to the father's compassion for the sinful son. But he answered his father, Behold, these many years I have served you, and I never disobeyed a commandment of yours, but you never gave me a goat, that I might celebrate with my friends. But when this, your son, came, who has devoured your living with prostitutes, you killed the fattened calf for him. Luke 15 29 30, World English Bible The Father explains, But it was appropriate to celebrate and be glad, for this, your brother, was dead, and is alive again. He was lost, and is found, Luke 15:32. Rembrandt was moved by the parable, and he made a variety of drawings, etchings, and paintings on the theme that span decades, beginning with a 1,636 etching, see gallery. The return of the prodigal son includes, figures not directly related to the parable but seen in some of these earlier works, their identities have been debated. The woman at top left, barely, visible, is likely the mother while the seated man, whose dress implies wealth, may be an advisor to the estate or a tax collector.